precise though. Martin, Yonkers, Jim Yonkers going to the line, oh he's lost it! That is a superb tackle, Chris Sedlinski, that's why they wanted him so much in this side. What is great feet by Yonkers, get out of Connie's hand, but that, what a tackle! Terry Newton, good long pass, Farrell, good support play. Oh. Oh. Newton again. Riggan have an overlap out wide here now. They've got a chance here now. Dallas in the corner. That's the first try. Superb effort. Wonderful hanging across the field. Really spreading on the uh, St. Helens defence. And the first points on the board for Wigan. Brett Dallas, the man. He's caught an injury in it, but uh, superb play. And certainly moving this ball out, they've been criticised a little for playing down the middle, but here's another chance. Farrell again, he's got Dallas again. He's said, now then, can he go? No, he can't. Terrific tackle there from Paul Adams. He tracked him down the touchline, but it's all Wigan at the moment. Adrian Lamb, snip and stub of a kick, it's a chase. Oh, he misses it. And Chris Radlinski, he seems to be everywhere. Well, if there's something wrong with his foot, I'll have two of them, Jonathan. <laughs> Look at this, you know, the angle's right. Ooh, a little nudge there by Locke. O'Neill and Lamb, this boy Adrian Lamb from Papua New Guinea causing a lot of damage in midfield. He's got the ball away, there is Lamb! Oh, and Lamb is over! Adrian Lamb from Papua New Guinea! He's in for the second try of the afternoon! And the Wigan fans can hardly believe it! They were classed as underdogs all week! And yet they've started in sensational form. Skullcock rather. But on the fifth tackle. Long this time. Good left footed kick. Nolan! Absin Hallam scored. Yeah, I believe they have. Easy to use it, right? That's the difference between a good kick and a poor kick. That's the first good kick they had on the last last tackle. Cunningham going himself. Oh, he's shot this man. Has he got it down on his right? It's his foot underneath it. Well, that would be ironical. Is that the foot? Cunningham. He's given it. No, I, I'm not sure. Has he got? I'm not sure what's happened here. I think he's gone to the camera array, he hasn't given it his... But I'd rather video referee Ray Tennant be doing that than me. Is he going to give it back to the ref? Oh, here we go. Well, I think we'll be having a decision shortly. We'll know very shortly. No try! Cutting him again! Great tackle, Ferner again. What a tackle! Long moves it out wide, but again a loose pass. Gleason going for the line. He's got it down. Oh, tremendous sidestepping run from the youngster, the Wigan-born lad, against his hometown team, Martin Gleason. Just signed this season for St Helens from Huddersfield, and he puts Saints right back in the game. El Gore. Long. Good ball out there. Oh! An attempted pass by Chris Joyne, but again, good tackling there, Gary Connolly. Now watch what he does here. He knows that he's attracting the defenders. Tries to get his hands through. Look, one-handed ball. Just couldn't get his hands through. He could take someone away. Great dummy. He's got Sean Long. Oh, good tackling again by Radnitsky. He read that well. He went for long straight away. Watch this, great full back play. Look, he reads the play so well, two on one. Maybe Scully will, will look back and reflect. He should have thrown the dummy. And Albert. Oh, good run by Albert. Now he really can run. He's got Radlinski on the outside. Will he go himself? He does. What a fantastic tackle from Radlinski. Oh, this, this man is having a, a terrific game. I think Radlinski should have four days in hospital before every game the way he's played today. He's been superb. <laughs> 
I'm going to see if I can get that infection. <laughs> Here he goes, watch his tackle, gets his feet in the right position. That is a magnificent tackle. Not only does he stop him, puts him on his back, look, tries to, to give his defence time to get back. Great discipline, great discipline. Tremendous. That's why right. right. so tight, the discipline has been good. You know, they just oh haven't uh, given away field position. Lamb. Julian O'Neill. Good break by Julian O'Neill. He's got the ball away. A chance here for Wigan now. O'Neill's side. There is it. Kicks in, and I think that you know it could turn our way. That's an ancient Helen's here now. He's a jump for Sean Long. Sean Long going to the right. Oh, Ainsco has got him. Terrific comedy by Ainsco. But St. Helen's in full flow here now. They've got six or seven men out to the left. Shields. Has he taken the wrong option? No, he's got the pass out. Here's a chance for Cunningham. Wigan desperately defending here now. St. Helen's going for the line. Yorkers can't get over. He can't. Redlinski again. That's a superb attack by Redlinski once again. Wigan perhaps looking for the try to clinch this match. Here's the drop ball attempt. Adrian Lamb. The referee just consulting with the touch judges. And a drop goal there. Well read by Wigan. You won't be surprised to hear this, but the Lance Todd trophy for the man of the match goes to the Wigan Warriors fullback. Chris Radlinski, who was uh, a doubt right up until the start of this game. What an incredible week it's been for him. Brian Carney, there it is. It's all over. A smile of Morris Lindsay's face. It is endlessly. Great Wigan game is a game. It's a of the 2002 Kellogg's Nutri Grade Challenge Cup. To be presented by the Right Honourable Richard Caborne MP, the Minister for Sport. Ladies and it was Andy Parrott's goal kicking that proved the difference. 2002. The 2002 Wigan Challenge Wigan Cup winner, Wigan. The 17th Challenge Cup win, the third in a final over St. Helens, and significantly after those eight successive wins in the 80s and the 90s, a first success in seven years. Lost to St. Helens in 61 and 66, they won in 89 and 91, and now in 2002 it's Andy Parnell and uh, Boris Lindsay who can afford to smile. Wigan are back. They are back, and uh, you know, I think since the, the game came fully professional, I think everyone's slowly caught up with Wigan. But uh, they've they've been a great team. They always will be a great team, and uh, never, never write them off. And they will go from strength to strength, and they will be serious contenders for the Super League team. As will, of course, and Helens. They will bounce back. Stradlinski there, just uh, acknowledging the support of Boris uh, Lindsay.